Hi guys, I'm Salman Riaz from Era24 UK. After a long time, I'm going to bring this new video, which is uh, we are going to create a server. As I know that everyone is doing uh, web designing and they need a hosting. So I thought I should share this video with you and you can have this server on your local machine. It doesn't matter which one is it you can install on Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 10 and 11. So let's get started. So once you will go there, you will see this kind of page because we are going to access our local host and local host will be showing this message. So we need to install a software. We are going to Google and then in search bar you are going to write XAMPP download and then the first link you will see this one just click on it and then you will come up on this page so once you are here on this page then you will see a download XAMPP Apache friends you need to click on it once you will click on it you will come up on this page and here you will see the XAMPP for Windows there are the version of XAMPPs 7429 8019 816 so these are for windows as soon as you will scroll you will start seeing some other for linux and for apple os and there is an add-on uh, if you want to install you can install wordpress block this is an xam add-on now we are going to choose the file this one which is the latest version or if you are using any Windows 7 8 or 8.1 then you can install this version which is 7429 and PHP 7429 as well so you can download for your 64 bit Windows machine but I will say we will go for the latest one which is 816 and PHP 816 so you just click on it and you will see this page download is completed now we are going to click on it and then run the software so you can close this page as we have done and download it software will take some time to get installed so once you uh, start installing this is the message will come up so no need to worry about it is just user account control message and you can click ok yes setup next you are going to select the server items the server uh, items are apache mysql filezilla ftp server mercury mail server tomcat and the program languages you are going to install php perl other program languages are php my admin webilizer and fake send mail so these all you need for all different kinds of your projects and for softwares so click next the by default uh, location is c it is going to be installed in c if you want to install in any other directory you can click on it and choose as per your requirement click next this software is available in two languages english and deutsch so you can choose english as you can see this is the message come up just uncheck because you don't want to learn more about bitnami click next again next and now it is installing The installation will take some time so please have patience so this is the way we are going to complete the installation now almost is finishing
now it is creating an installer in case if you don't want to install or don't like this software you can uninstall it here you go do you want to start your control panel now yes we we'll leave it like this finish as you can see here is a small icon so it is starting right now so once you will see this panel it means you are exam control panel version 3.3.0 and now we are going to start apache so just click on it start it is started you can see here it is green now start mysql it is also green allow your firewall click on it access allow if you are going to use firezilla then you can use and start this button otherwise leave as it is now we are going to check our local host after starting these both modules we will write localhost enter so it means your XAMPP server is installed properly we also say localhost in other language or with IP address 127.0.0.1 so you can just refresh it and you can see this is the same page came up so this is the way you can install your own server and have a server for websites WordPress or any kind of website you can run with database thank you for watching